the absence of imagination may contribute to a sense of stagnation in life. As the mind requires stimulation of one kind or another to expand its comprehension of the world. Without imagination to aid in the pursuit, one may find the task more difficult. For the imagination helps to bridge the gap between the life one aspires to, and the life one experiences daily. Learning to harness its raw potential, increases the likelihood of a positive outcome in one's pursuits. As imagination has the potential to envision one's goals already achieved, through the process of visualization, the gap between one's aspired goal is gradually dissolved. The individual finds themselves existing inside of the desired moment of completion. The arduous mountain path all but conquered. To visualize oneself within this moment, unlocks the door prohibiting one's advance. Although it is a vision of the mind, moments of focused attention create the necessary space for imagination to flourish. This helps an individual develop an accurate picture of what they seek to create. Once a decisive goal is settled upon, the path forward appears less daunting. Integrating a vision with a long-term goal clears the path for one to proceed. The process of visualization, providing a unique insight into the world within. By cultivating thought, one lays the foundation to build something of genuine substance. Through focused effort, the elusive nature of the vision begins to manifest. As the mind expands its comprehension of reality, aspects of the hidden realm begin to seep into thoughts. The more one focuses upon a particular outcome, the closer it appears. Although the goal is yet to be achieved, it exists as complete within the mind's eye. Once an individual learns to harness the infinite potential of imagination, nothing exists beyond their reach. The focused efforts of the mind lays the groundwork for action on the physical plane. For the work cannot commence without decisive action being taken. Any attempt at undertaking the endeavor without a definitive plan risks undermining the original intention. Unless an individual feels confident enough to undertake a project, it lives on in conceptual form. Though the longer a vision is shelved, the risk of inaction begins to creep in. For the physical construct is built upon the foundation of thought forms. As the conceptual world of thought provides the blueprint which underpins the process of manifestation. The act of suppression denies an individual the opportunity to convey genuine aspects of their innermost being. Without a physical outlet to express the numerous aspects of thought, the mind is unable to communicate with the physical world. A situation of this nature only serves to disempower the creative potential of the mind. The denial of a healthy outlet to express one's innermost thoughts contributes to a sense of mental stagnation. Unless an individual is empowered by their thoughts, the chances of breaking free of society's mold to create something truly unique are few and far between. As positive thoughts are required for constructive manifestations,